there are two main types of bariatric surgery. By far the most common is gastric bypass. Surgeons staple shut most of the stomach, then reattach the small intestine from below. It reduces the volume of the stomach. From about the size of a melon to the size of a plum, it's so much smaller. It simply means you can't eat as much food and the weight comes off. Then there's gastric banding. It works in exactly the same way, but an adjustable band restricts the stomach. It's a more simple op that carries a higher risk of later complications. 5,000 bypasses and band surgeries are now performed in the UK each year, but at 10,000 pounds a pop, should the NHS be paying? It is not really expensive when you look at it in relative terms to how much it would cost uh, to treat the diseases which you get from being obese. So just to give you an example, uh, just if you're a diabetic, it costs the NHS approximately £3,000 a year to treat one patient. It's why many NHS trusts want to see more morbidly obese patients go under the knife. But is tackling the acute end of the obesity epidemic with surgery the smartest long-term option?